What happens when a dream adventure suddenly takes a dramatic turn? For Riley and Elena of Sailing La Vagabond, a peaceful night at anchor became a terrifying ordeal when their yacht was struck by a fishing vessel. Known for their breathtaking sailing adventures and family-centered content, the La Vagabond crew recently faced a challenge that reminded everyone just how unpredictable life at sea can be. But let us make things clear, they escaped unharmed, but sadly, they will not be able to continue their journey for some time. Stay with us to know the details. But first, those of you who are not familiar with Riley and Elena, then let's us give you a brief introduction. In 2014, Riley, a 39-year-old ex-miner from Australia, met Elena, a 30-year-old musician, on the Greek island of Ios. Despite knowing each other for only a few weeks, they set off on a bold adventure aboard La Vagabond, Riley's 2007 Beneteau Cyclades sailboat. What began as an escape from routine soon turned into a way of life, inspiring millions. Their YouTube channel, Sailing La Vagabond, started as a small project but has since attracted nearly 2 million followers. Over 90,000 nautical miles later, their incredible journey continues to capture the highs, lows, and magic of life at sea. Riley and Elena of Sailing La Vagabond have turned their adventurous lifestyle into a thriving brand, boasting an estimated net worth of over $2 million. Their income flows from YouTube, where 2 million monthly views fuel ad revenue, along with fan support on Patreon, merchandise sales, and their popular SLV Essential Sale Guide. Now getting to this recent event. As we mentioned earlier, the La Vagabond crew faced a horrifying accident when their yacht was struck by a fishing vessel. Riley and Elena, along with their two children and three crew members, were sound asleep when the collision occurred. Thankfully, no one was injured, but the yacht sustained significant damage. This forced the family to put their journey on hold indefinitely. Well, the accident, still under investigation by local authorities, could have been far worse. Despite their relief at avoiding injuries, Riley and Elena were left shaken by the experience. In the days that followed, the couple addressed their fans, thanking them for their overwhelming support while also calling out inaccuracies reported by some media outlets. It's been two weeks since the incident, and the family has chosen to step away from creating content to focus on their emotional recovery and assess the damage to their beloved yacht. Fans are rallying behind them, flooding social media with messages of encouragement and relief that everyone is safe. In addition to dealing with the collision, Riley also had to respond to a Japanese article that misrepresented the event. This created a new layer of frustration, but the couple has vowed to stay focused on their recovery and push for a thorough investigation by local authorities. What are your thoughts on Riley and Elena's journey with Sailing La Vagabond and how they're handling this recent setback? Share your honest opinion in the comments below and let us know when you first started following their incredible adventures. Until next time, take care and see you soon.